morning. My name is Karen Nielsen. I have been a member of Woodlake Church since 1983. I'm currently serving as vice president of the congregation. When Pastor Micah and Pastor Neil first asked the board members to make these videos, at first I have to admit I was terrified. I didn't know what I could say to you that would be meaningful and helpful. And with the beauty shops closed, how could I appear on video without a makeover? <clears throat> My daughter reminded me, just let the Holy Spirit in. You'll find the words. So after praying about it, I felt confident that I could do it. Over the past year, I've been writing a collection of poems based on the Old and New Testament stories. Um, today, I would like to share my rhyming version of the 23rd Psalm with you. It has always brought me comfort and reassurance during stressful times. Psalm 23, verses 1 through 6. The Lord is my provider. There is nothing that I need. All my wants and my desires are given to me indeed. As I lie down in green meadows and rest beside the streams, my soul is restored, I am content to follow all my dreams. I'll live my life in righteousness, my path guided by the Lord. And even when my death is near, I will not fear the sword. For God is with me all my days, he offers up his grace until the time he calls me and I see his heavenly face. And when my enemies gather in, he makes them change their ways. Then we all sit down together and his holy name we praise. He anoints my head with precious oils, a bounty set before. I know that love and goodness will be mine forevermore. My heavenly father has prepared a place, so surely I will dwell forever in his loving arms, refreshed and safe and well. I want to thank Pastor Micah and Pastor Neil for all that they are doing during this time of isolation and fear. It is so comforting to know that we are all as one against this difficult time and that they are like shepherds, loving and protecting their sheep. Thank you too to all the staff for keeping us informed and for all that they do. I miss you all, <clears throat> and I pray that you keep safe and well. And remember, there is always hope when we trust in Jesus Christ. Let us pray. Thank you, Lord, for the opportunity to reach out to my Woodlake family. I pray that the words of the 23rd Psalm give comfort and hope to all your people. Amen. See you in church. Thank you.